really tricky. We are doing something a little bit different today. Um, we are headed on the schedule, front range guide service, spring snows. I was on the computer about, I don't know, eight or nine days ago. I was on the phone with Cade. We were booking flights, getting everything synced up out of Little Rock. And I saw these flights that were $20 on Thursday, but they were like 300 on Friday. And I just got this crazy idea. I was like, Kyle doesn't get in until seven on Friday. Do you want to go skiing? So he was like, I've never been. That sounds awesome. So we booked the $20 flights. We stayed in a hotel on the west side of Denver and we're going to the Loveland ski area. Kate's gonna go skiing for the first time and we don't know how it's gonna go. Kate, what do you think? Uh, I don't really know what to expect. Uh, we're gonna give her a go. I'm sure it. You think you're gonna be good? Yeah. Give me 20 minutes, I'll have it down. Okay, 20 minutes. So this is not a, a skiing vlog, but we'll throw some fun stuff in there and then we'll get to the airport tonight and uh, we'll pick up Kyle. We'll make our way uh, to Front Range and we're gonna go kill some snow geese tomorrow. So today's a fun day for the boys. Ought to be a good time. Cade's excited, I'm excited. I love skiing. I think Cade's gonna love skiing. Oh, yeah. We'll see how it goes. Let's do it, let's go. All right, Cade's got his skis on. He made it on the lift. Let's go, dude. This is awesome. Riding up. This looks what so are you, fun. What dude. are you thinking? I'm ready. I have a feeling it'll be pretty bad out of the gate, but hopefully it won't take me too long to get it down. I think we'll get it. These guys look like they know what they're doing. Stay under control. <laughs> keep your center, keep your center over. <laughs> Stay under control. <laughs> it's not bad. It's getting a little fast. You're getting a little fast. I don't see this going real well. All right, turn and pie. Turn hard. <laughs> I got ahead of myself. <laughs> All right, Hollywood. You got a little confident. What do you think? <laughs> We're getting it. All right, so it's about 3:15. We've been skiing hard all day, and. I think it kind of kind of clicked with Kay. These Finally last couple, couple runs have been really good, and that one was really really good. So hopefully we can finish on a really really strong note, and then when he ever, you know comes back, it's just like hopping on a bicycle. You just pick right back up where you left off, and that last one was fun. It was a lot of fun. So completely different than what it's been. I've been falling like every hundred yards all day, and that one we didn't fall at all. Yeah, but it's been a lot better. Yeah, it's a beautiful day. We are gonna wrap it up and we are going to head to Nebraska. So we look forward to getting out there, killing some snow geese. This has been a fun little transition day. He's done pretty good. Only took him seven hours, but. There we go. There. Well, that was fun. We uh, wrapped up our day on the slopes. Cade got his first action on the skis. Cade, what'd you think about it, man? It was a blast, man. Really enjoyed it. Had a, had a rough start this morning. It took me a little while to get it, get it down. I don't know if I got it down, but get a little bit better at it. But by the end of the day, I was feeling pretty good. Um, I mean, I'll, I would definitely go back. It was a good time. You know, we said earlier on the way we were gonna get Kyle when we got done skiing. Well, About there. we kind of started doing some math and we realized we're losing an hour 
headed to our destination. Kyle was getting in late already, and then we started thinking, okay, it's gonna be 1.30-ish, maybe two o'clock before he gets in. I think we're gonna head on and let him get a rental. So that's exactly what we did, is we, uh, we had a pretty good drive ahead of us, almost five hours total. And Kyle got a rental, so right now we're about an hour away uh, from our friend Colton Caldwell. And uh, we're gonna hunt some snow geese tomorrow. What's up guys, we are back, and look who we've got with us. How was that drive last night, Kyle? It was long, long and tiring. <laughs> what time did you get in last night? Two, almost two o'clock. Dude got in at two o'clock and slept on the floor. I looked Bro. over, I was like, dude, Kyle's not here. He hasn't made it yet. Mm. And then he's like, dude, I pops up. up out of the floor, <laughs> dude, fully clothed. I woke up to my first alarm, looked over, and he wasn't in bed. And I was like, damn. Yeah, you sent me a text. You're like, I was like, I, I was you like, good? literally, I wasn't even awake yet. I was like, I looked at I, the last time I texted you last night, you didn't respond. I was like, you good? Went back to sleep, woke up my next alarm, looked over. Still not there. I'm like, yo, where's Kyle? And he's like, I'm here. And he's like, on the floor. <laughs> he popped up, man. But uh, we're here now, man. We're all here. We're all tired. But uh, that's that's the name of the game, man. It, it, it's not our first rodeo. So we're ready to rock and roll. We just met uh, Colton Caldwell. Uh, we're actually in the minivan. The uh, Chrysler Pacifica. Pacifica. And the G -Wag. they drove out into the field. We actually just followed them over here. They drove out into the field to kind of find the sweet spot where they wanted, and then they're gonna come back and get us because we're in the mini, and uh, we're we're not gonna risk driving out there. So uh, we're excited. Um, like I said last night, I believe we are gonna be in the spread. We got a little bit of wind, so we'll see what happens. Is this your first day hunting snow geese this spring? This spring, yep, yep, and sweet. first first true spring snow goose hunt in the central flyway so i've only hunted them in the mississippi flyway so, right on. so pretty stoked about it here we are let's do this we'll be back soon let's go time boys that's what it is <laughs> that's all good man what up bro what's up good morning <laughs> <laughs> what do y'all need help carrying here Man, we don't have that much. Really, just camera stuff. Okay. Hey guys, Colton Caldwell here, Front Range Guide Service. Today we are setting our snow spread here in Nebraska. We hunt kind of central western Nebraska. Um, we're going to hunt a bunch of adults today. They've been in here for a couple days now. I think there's been about 5,000 in here. There's been about a million over on the lake, and that's no joke when I actually say a million. So hopefully it goes well. Let's do it. What do you think about all this? It's pretty cool. It's awesome. It's a great experience. They've done a great job so far yesterday. It's been a little tough with the adults, but yeah. clients got a band yesterday, which is super awesome. It's always good. Yeah, definitely. Even on these slow days, you know, yeah. It'll it's definitely cool make a slow experience. day a lot better. Oh, absolutely. Sure. Definitely. Maybe we'll see. Today. Hopefully. It'll be awesome. <laughs> the juvie in the spread right here. <laughs> oh, great bag. <laughs> Yeah. Alright guys, we are in the spread. Birds are flying. Sun's coming up. It's looking good. Check this out. Reload. 
Nail that, Foxy. We both show up at the same time. Nice. Come on. Good one to break the ice. Yep. Yeah, it's on that. We got. Yeah, all right. Live action. Coming back, coming back. Getting told right there. Somebody hit him. Oh, no! What do you think? What do you think, Reed? <laughs> they, they, they sat there and just worked on down. We're seeing plenty of birds, but there's literally no wind. Um, it's, you know, they're just getting on top of us and hanging, so uh, it's supposed to be picking up throughout the, the day, and uh, we should be getting some more, but we're chipping away, we're shooting some, uh, getting some good looks. Nice love one. update, Cole. Another adult. One more adult to add to the pile. Rocking up the adults with no wind. Love it. Mom! Dude, turn them. Look at that. Mm. On a... Mom! On a dime. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Mouth calling Snow Goose World Championship. I'm coming for it. Come on, boy. Watch that one. Dude, the bottom fell out Dude, of that, that thing. that was gross. Yes! <laughs> oh my goodness, that's what we've been waiting for. Punch. Yes, a little bit of punch. wind and a little bit of spice. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That was like the whole middle of the <laughs> That's what we wake up at 4 a.m. for, guys. I'm glad I see that. I live every day for that clock. Let's go. Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> Did you guys dump the tubes or what? <laughs> Almost. Okay. Okay. Hey Colton, I'm glad I seen that block. Yeah, no <laughs> I just looked up and like, they're on us. They're coming. Just a little bit of wind, man. That's all it took, huh? I might go get that deep That's what I kept telling these guys. I'm like, big I'm like this is what happens when you get some wind and they're I'm just telling hanging you, there. man. There's still a lot of birds up there. Yeah, there still is a big flock coming. We should probably just wait on that one, don't you think, Mark? Huh? That deep one? I don't even see it down. It's, it's nice. between two, on, the right? two dark trees in the house. It's right? between the two dark trees. That was pretty sweet, dude. <laughs> that was awesome. Hopefully, uh, we can keep that train rolling. That's right. Dude, Colton got so hyped. <laughs> He's like, let's go! I thought he just shot a buck deer. <laughs> like he just hit an overtime game winner. <laughs> Buzzer baby. I got nervous there for a sec. They like flared for a second. Yeah, second. I did too. Oh, I was like, oh, oh no. Fox. Oh, that was cool. It's funny, just for a minute, we kind of gave up on them. We were like, oh, okay, we're going to we sit around, kind of stretch a little bit. Birds kind of stopped flying some. And we thought we were going to kind of pack it up well then a group came and we kind of got down and we've kind of just been in and there's been a few groups coming here and there and then finally i don't know 15 minutes ago it just started getting a little puff of wind and then a little bit more you know maybe gusting up to five or six right now it's not much maybe seven 
at times, and it's supposed to be climbing. Uh, so I don't know how much longer we've got this morning. I don't know how many more groups we're going to get a shot at. But uh, I'll give it a, give it a little bit longer. See what happens. Oh, I'm gonna hit this one. Dude, it hit the dog. This far? It hit the dog. It hit Reed, bro. I went deep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nice. yeah. That went out there. Nice. That hit my dog. Give me dog. some. <laughs> yeah. That was awesome. That was fun. Dude, that literally hit Reed on the head, bro. Reed, look at him. He's like, look. Dude. He's like, He's like, I didn't even look, it landed right there. Yeah, that's the goose. That's where it landed. Yeah, I shot that, that back pair. <laughs> you got both of them? No, the very back pair, I got yeah. one. You got, got one? one? Nice. Yeah. I was hoping, that's why I was waiting for so long. I was hoping they could get further and somebody could get one of those. Dude, what do you think? Dude, this is turning out to be fun. <laughs> this is so much fun. This All is, adults. It really is fun, dude. This is a lot of fun. Yeah. A lot. Decoying snow geese is underrated. Really a lot is. of people shoot them at like 50 or 60 yards, but I mean, getting them close is definitely a thing. You just yeah. got to be patient and let them come. Absolutely. But when they do, it's sweet. That's a snow Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. You ready? Oh my gosh. Dude, I'm still rolling. Get same, ready. same clip. Oh, shit. Oh, no, the dog didn't catch it. Don't shoot the dog. Kill it. Kill it. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> that was sickening. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh man! Look how great he is, dude. You pummeled him. Son! Right here. Oh, yeah. Let's just get down. Lot more coming. We got some Migs coming from the left. <laughs> Dude, you got that instant replay? All right, well, that's a wrap for this morning's hunt. I think we ended up. How many would yield? 28 or something. Cole, how many would we end up with? Uh, I think we are at. 25 or 26. 25. Yeah. Shot 25 this morning. We're going to go. It's about noon now. We're going to go grab some lunch, maybe take a nap, and uh, come out. What time is that? Probably about 4 o'clock. 4 o'clock this afternoon. We got a lot more wind coming this afternoon as well. So it should be pretty good this afternoon. This morning was fun. It was pretty good. It got better as the morning went on. But I think this afternoon will be better. Um, but for now, let's go get some food. Let's do it. Bro. I need a pre-game interview. <laughs> pre-game interview. Get out of here, bro. Dude, what are you dude, doing? We went to the Mexican restaurant for lunch, <laughs> and uh, nobody seems to have any toilet paper around here. So we're sacrificing this Walmart camo shirt. It's the last hunt of the season. We'll restock before next, before 2022. Good luck. All right, I'll catch you out there. So we're going back out for round two. Cade's got to take a little bit of break. But we ate lunch. Colton and Cade, they went, uh, did a little bass fishing. They caught three smallmouth, which is pretty cool. So we're headed back to the spread now. We have the wind that we needed this morning. The wind is ripping now, and it's looking right. We actually already had one that tried to do it before we got back to the spread. So let's just hope uh, some others give us a chance, because I think if they come over, it's looking good right now. I think we're gonna get them. What do you think, man? I think it's gonna be pretty good. I mean, if it's anything like the last two did it, they're gonna have a hard time getting out. It's gonna be good. It'll be close. All right. We had even made.
made it out there yet. We saw they turned the motion decoys on and they got a little group that are crawling down the arm of the spread. If I can find them, there they are. Let's see how they do. Oh, they're looking right, boys. Oh, keep coming, boys. Keep coming. Keep coming. They're coming, they're coming. Oh, yeah. We're about to get a nice view of this. Oh, what? One's dropping. Boom. Let's see what they have to say about that group. In the, the two look. volleys we've been here for, in a matter of five minutes, they've deep, it's been better than that was mine. than any time this morning. So. and lost his hat. <laughs> He's running hard and lost his hat. We're taking a big dump. <laughs> Look at that. There's our Rossi. first Rossi of the day, bud. Look at this. Look at this skit. He's going to be so out of breath. 
How did that Under Armour shirt work out? She's no longer with us. <laughs> <laughs> Sacrifices have been made. It wasn't Under Armour, it was Walmart. Oh, it was Walmart? I wouldn't treat Under Armour like this. <laughs> Why are you holding it like it's got a band? Oh. You scared me. Dude, they are absolutely loving it. Dude, they are yeah. eating that five it pack from a mile away. Literally, I never turned around. Checked up. I saw that five pack in the distance, so I lay down. They never even, they never flapped their wings. Huh. Dude, that was they awesome watching it come back. This wind, man. The whole way. How close were they when they shot them? Dude, that five right pack. Here, man. Yeah. on the first shot, you know Kyle missed. I'm staying on the blue. Getting tight. No pressure. Kill up! <laughs> yeah! Got him! Yee! <laughs> Wallpaper Wednesday! <laughs> Dad, why's this guy got a camera in my face? There's a blue. What did you say? That when you the gun. Uh, I think he's okay. I don't know. Come here, Reed. Come on. Oh, that's a great Come here. Come here. Nice. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he's pretty, but yeah. Best yeah, I thought I thought same thing. <laughs> I never check. know, dude. <laughs> Gotta check them all. Still a beaut though. Dude, yeah. Is that your first stud blue? It's it's one of first my first ones you, you know you shot. Yeah. Oh yeah. I crushed him and then he got he got crushed again. Yeah, he definitely um, did. Oh, he, was, he was the target in the group. Oh sure. yeah. I mean <laughs> you come in a good one, though. in a group of three geese. Yeah. Two of them are adult snows and Reed, I like your vest, bro. I like that vest. It's swag, dog. <laughs> Fire. <laughs> Dude, that's great swag. Okay, thank you. 
What do you think, man? What's that? Dude, what do you think? Those came in sweet, didn't they? Dude, this is fun. We're winding them up this afternoon, today. It's amazing how much the wind changes the day. Oh, I know. It's Literally, like, this morning, completely different story from this afternoon. If they're low out there a mile, you know it's they're over. coming. Yeah, you Hook, line, really and sinker. Just, Here we just come. Just sit back and get ready. <laughs> Yeah, that's how you know you're shooting them close. Son, that's our hide right there. Right at 40 on the day. Um, we got almost an hour left of day of shooting light, so you know they're flying. Um, it's pretty. I don't want to say it's slow, um, but it's just kind of. Oh, hold on. There's a single coming in. Hey, if he gets close, shoot him. Don't don't wait or anything. Watch this. He's about to get munched. Someone kill him! Well, forgot what I was saying, but that makes somewhere around 41 for the afternoon, or for the day. Um, give it. Gotta love them gray ones. <laughs> oh my gosh. What up, son? Yo. Yo. I, just, I don't know about y'all, but y'all having pretty fun out here. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. This is a fun hunt. Yeah, yeah it is. It's a blast. Just out here chilling. And we're shooting them close, yeah. man. This ain't no like steel curtain snow goose hunt. This no, is dude, like we're laying in the socks the and shooting them. Do it! That one's hit. Yeah! We sailing. How many did you get out of there? Huh? How many did you get out of there? Oh, still shot drop down there. Dude, you're getting reps on the camera. Dude, I know. Straight. Wall <laughs> paint. Anytime I look over, you got that thing in your grill. <laughs> Dude, wallpaper Wednesday. <laughs> Does that dog take a uh, blind? Uh, Here, boy. Good. Bye. Dude, those things were close. Yeah. First, this ain't no steel curtains, huh? First, another good blue. First one I went for. Nice. Yeah. We got the power master over there doing his thing. Yeah. I can guarantee you. You've never seen somebody that makes a pile as clean and as neat as a Tolly 24. That's not a gear on T. Not even remotely close. No, nothing even. Hey, nothing even gets close. Get up. Hey, Asher. How crispy is that line? What? How crispy is that pile? It's crispy, dog. <laughs> Alright, everybody back in. I was probably wondering why we're like setting the pile right now. Well, afternoon hunting, uh, sun's setting pretty fast. And uh, we just want to make sure we get a good picture at the end because if we wait until the conclusion of shooting time, it's going to be way too late to get a presentable picture with good light. So. That's why we're kind of in between groups, working on setting the pile. Look, 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 look. Is that a goose? Look, oh, look, 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 look. Is this a goose out front? Set the settings. Ha ha, Seagull, better not. Set the settings on your camera real fast. Dude, what's good with that airway hoodie? Dude, this thing is freaking awesome. For any of you guys that are laying in cornfields, necessarily have to wear white even if you are laying in a white spray as you can see I'm kind of dressed as a corn stalk right now my whole outfit looks the same color as this field and honestly I feel like I look better blend in better wearing this than I do a white hoodie all right guys I got a question for y'all me and Asher have kind of had an ongoing disagreement um, one day it has to do with uh, deli sandwiches one day back during earlier in this year we were on the road and uh, we stopped in at uh, Jersey Mike's to get a sandwich and I thought it was terrible. My, the sandwich was no good. It was just 
it just wasn't wasn't as good as Subway. And I told him that Subway was better than Jersey Mike's, and he thinks I'm an idiot for saying that. So I need y'all to put a comment down there in the in the comment section and tell me which one's better, Subway or Jersey Mike's. You can put a comment telling them how wrong he is, because Jersey Mike's is legit, and Subway is just dude. Not. Subway isn't even close to Jersey Mike's. They put that You're freaking. Right, they, it's not. Yeah, because Subway's because here and Jersey Mike's here. Dude, they put that freaking tomato paste on those sandwiches. You can leave it's that terrible. off, you know. Mike's way, ass. Dude, you're hot. Are these bars? You're hot, dude. Hustle, go. Gray's on the bottom, everybody knows the rules. <laughs> Especially the super greasy crusty ones. This thing's like, looks like Cade. Fresh. Looks like what? It still looks like me. <laughs> Damn, bro. Why you gotta do me like that? The super greasy crusty one. What do you think, bull? Oh my God, man. Yeah, that was a fun day, wasn't awesome it? Awesome day. Awesome day. It don't hardly get no better. It doesn't get better, man. That's a good time right there. <laughs> that was when? One, two, three. Three, here. All right, that was absolutely awesome. We uh, we ended with 50 birds. Uh, they wanted it this morning, and we, we started out pretty hot. We ended up killing 25, but we just didn't have any wind. We talked about it in the truck, the wind showed up for us and the birds that came back, they ran it up pretty good. Yeah, they wanted it. We didn't see very many tonight, but the ones that we did, Dude, they just are committed. This afternoon was textbook, like, that's how you draw it up. The ones when they were out there three quarters of a mile, like, you knew it was yeah. quite a sinker. Dude, you, you had the hook There were so many of them just yeah. balled up, never checked up one time, it was like, here they come, man. All the way to our yeah. feet. That was absolutely And they still want to get in here. Look at that. All right, guys, that's a wrap. We are back in the car. We just uh, pulled out of the field. We are gonna head back to the hotel first. We're probably gonna stop and get a bite to eat because it's been a long day. We're all pretty exhausted, but what a day. talk about being well worth it. That yeah. was awesome. Dude, that, that was that was the best decoying snow geese I've ever I've ever witnessed, let alone shot into. And Easily. we were laying in the spray. Easily, dude. It was, just, it was just close, a lot of fun, man. man. These guys, I said it on video, but don't uh, don't underestimate them when it comes to snow geese because... Uh, you get it done. Yeah, yeah. nice. The, the spread was awesome. The hide was awesome. And even this morning, to, to not have really any wind um, and yeah. still shot 25 or 26 this morning and being adults with no wind in the spread... That was pretty dang strong, but yeah. this afternoon when we got the wind, didn't see probably what a, a fifth of what we saw this morning, mm. but the birds the we saw, we they sure liked it. So the next move is uh, figuring out what we're gonna eat, and then uh, we're gonna get horizontal and yeah. uh, catch a few. You dig them right. So I need a shower. Yeah, I think uh, I think <laughs> we all need a shower. So you guys got anything else? No. Man, I like the video comment subscribe please please do please let us know if you liked it if you uh, like this time we had stuff, fun yeah, making it so we hope you guys liked it because we'd love to make a whole lot more yeah because that was a heck of a lot of fun so let us know what you think uh in the comments uh we'd love to have you subscribe to the channel we'll keep bringing some more awesome content until next time thanks guys peace peace and when you hear the sound of the drum, we'll be saying, here we come.